Hello, this is a video on the Folders plugin to be used in WordPress. As far as I know, when you're looking at the media library, there is no way to organize things into folders. So I found this plugin, and this video will demonstrate that. So I'll be demonstrating this on the WordPress site. So let's go ahead and look at the dashboard. And if we go to our plugins, we'll see here the folders plugin is right here. And we need to take a look at the folder settings. I'm going to be using this to make my attachments, my attached documents, and my graphics. So I'm going to check that. I'm going to save changes. And you'll notice what it does is it adds a media folders here underneath my media. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to add a new folder next. I'm going to create a folder called Bomber Planes. So I'm going to do that now. So here are the folders that I have created. Now I'm going to show you how to put files into the folder. So I come over to the media library itself. And in order to do this, you act like you're editing. So I'm going to take this first one. I'm going to hit Edit. And over on the right-hand side here, we'll see the folders. And I'm going to put that into Bomber Planes. And I'm going to hit Update. And then when I come back to my library, I see that this first graphic is in the folder. Unfortunately, right now, you cannot do this with a, a, a mass shift in there. You have to do these individually. But they tell me that on the next update, then there's going to be a way to put a large number of files into a folder. Okay, so I have taken my bomber graphics and put them in the bomber planes folder, and I'm looking at the media library here, and you see that I have a variety of uh, files. Now, if I want to just look at the bomber planes only, I can go right here, and all of these are going to be bomber planes folder only. Now, I'd like to show you how to put a graphic onto a page. I'm going to go to this events page <clears throat> and I'm going to edit the page. And I just want to put a little graphic down here at the bottom. So I'm going to get an insertion point. And then I'm going to hit add media. You'll notice here that I don't have access to my folders. So I've found a good workaround using the insert from URL. So I'm going to back out and get the URL. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my media folders. And I'm going to go to the, the bomber planes. This is where all my bomber planes are. And I'm going to get this one right here. I'm going to hit edit. And right over here is the URL. So I'm going to copy that with Control C. And then I'm going to navigate back to my page. Here's the page I want to edit. And I'm going to come down and get my insertion point down here. And then I'm going to hit Add Media. Insert from URL. I'm going to paste that there. And I'm going to insert into page. And now I have the graphic on the page. And I'll hit update. I always like to check it. Make sure it's correct. The last example I'd like to show is how to attach a document to a page. I have a folder here called scholarship forms. And I would like to put this PDF on the page. So I'm going to get the, the URL like I did before. Now I'm going to edit the page. Now I have my insertion point, and I'm going to add media. And I'm going to insert from URL again. It worked. Good luck using the folders plugin.